Welcome back, Pyros. Right, there's a couple videos already out, so I'm not the first one putting these out. But uh, a lot of times when I shoot out of these, these tubes I've probably shot out of, off of this rack. Close to 300 rounds at least. But uh, as they get older, the insides get little scars and whatnot. Debris builds up, and sometimes you have to force your canister shells down there. So anyway, what I do is, and I actually learned it off of YouTube. After every shot, and then I'll clean that. And then sometimes this one hadn't been cleaned. Like it can't rip. There we go. It gets a lot off. But every so often, this one I just picked up. Took me a minute to find it. Every so often, I run a wheel through it. And this is a 175 wheel. It's brand new. Uh, I've got an attachment out hooked to this. But the other wheel is bent up to where it doesn't really do the job like I want it to. So, um, yeah, a lot of shells come through this rack. It's just a cheap old poor man, right? But it does the job. So, uh, and then sometimes I'll even, I wouldn't do this with fiberglass. Oddly enough, I never have problems with my fiberglass. a little bit and then the rack will go upside down and dry out. I need it already clean for this weekend so and just leave it upside down. It'll dry out on its own. Anyway, I need one of these, and only we'll have to use this like maybe uh, a couple of times. For the most part, the toilet brush works. So, quick little how to. And uh, like I said, I didn't come up with this. Someone else on YouTube did, and I'm glad they did because it helped me a lot. So I uh, appreciate the view, Pyros. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.